a bit wheezy sometimes, but I'm pretty good right now. And Breathing isn't something Elijah Ullman takes for granted. It's like you're underwater and you're just about to come up because you can't breathe for that. You need to get that air, but you can't get up and it's scary. Yeah. Elijah needs his asthma inhaler, but experts say too many people think they have asthma when in fact they don't. Asthma medications are generally safe, but steroid inhalers can have side effects when taken long term, including a higher risk of infections and suppressed growth in kids. In a sharply worded analysis, two leading respiratory specialists in the UK said the diagnosis of asthma has been trivialized and inhalers dispensed for no good reason, becoming almost a fashion accessory. Elijah's doctor agrees. I think that we uh, use inhalers in a lot of cases where we haven't confirmed the diagnosis. And on the flip side, I think we may be missing some cases of, of asthma as well. Recent Canadian research shows a third of adults diagnosed with asthma don't have it and suggests that number is even higher in children. In some cases, what looks like asthma may be a viral infection. If your child is asked to take asthma medication longer than three to six months, then parents should perhaps be concerned and insist on the diagnostic tests uh, to, to confirm the diagnosis. Elijah's mom says regular visits help. We want for him to just be a happy, healthy kid and not have to use unnecessary treatments. So that's, that's the goal. Because asthma can be dangerous and even deadly, experts emphasize no one should stop taking their asthma medication without talking to their doctor first. Christine Burak, CBC News, Toronto.